So I brought the stick insect cage with the stick insects home today and two out of the three stick insects are doing well but fortunately the third one which I had noticed was getting close to molting, it's taking its skin off, seems to be having some trouble getting rid of that skin. So it's not looking too healthy, it's looking weak. So I'm going to see what I can do to help it get out of that skin. I might take it out of the cage, wet the skin and see if I can free up its front arms a bit. So the first thing I'm going to do is try and wet the skin around where it's having difficulty with those front legs trying to get the skin off. Hopefully that will mean the skin comes free a bit easier. But then I'm also just trying to get rid of as much as I can of the old skin without snipping its legs at all. So there's some to start with. Mm, there's a leg right the way along there. Ooh, I've got one free. I'll just keep wetting the ends of those. put it back in the cage back in the cage and get it to somewhere where it can eat so there it is having a rest now but hopefully it will settle down and get back to some good eating so that it is able to get some energy back to get those legs move it moving again. Uh, I don't hold a lot of hope for its well-being, pulling through all this, but uh, certainly wasn't going to last long, much longer. All caught up in its its old skin, and hopefully she end up as healthy as this lovely specimen here sticky number 65 I think it must be round about that and uh, there is what's left of the old skin those legs or well, some of the legs came off just perfectly but seemed to get tangled and caught and you can see those spiky bits that you could easily get uh, tangled and caught with. But quite a magnificent process for the old stick insect to come through.